Hello everyone and welcome to Fableheim and welcome back to our Theocratic Japan playthrough. We started about a week ago. If you missed that stream and you are interested, you can find it in the pinned comment down below. But today, we are in pursuit of the noblest of goals. Science. And that science is a simple question. Can we reseat the Japanese Emperor? For a little bit of historical background, you begin playing as the Japanese Shogunate in 1836. This is the roughly the end of the Edo period and the rule of the Tokugawa Shogunate. However, the Shogunate did not evict the Japanese Emperor. They simply uh, took over and started making all the decisions. And the Emperor was still there, hanging around, kind of like, Hey, this is my legitimacy. The Emperor is here. We're just in service. Quotation marks. To him. And someone informed me in the comments that according to this flag, theocratic Japan just took over the shogunate's role. The emperor is still there. I have no idea how they determined that, but I believe them. <laughs> Everything on the internet is true, right? So I was thinking, can we roundabout way reseat the Japanese emperor? And how we're going to test that is in my United States playthrough from a while ago, you start as a presidential republic. But if you switch to a monarchy from the presidential republic, you raise an emperor. So I was thinking we'll switch from theocracy to presidential republic and then switch to monarchy and see if it changes to an emperor. Now, as with any good scientific experiment, here's my hypothesis. No, I don't think it will. Because as you can see, the monarchy is tied to the landowner faction, which for Japan is the shogunate. The shogunate that I still, after how many years is it? A lot of years, almost 60 years, I still cannot unseat these bastards. I have tried so hard, but they just have uh, such a tight grip on the country. So further ado, these are my laws, by the way. Uh, I do want to change quite a few of them, but it's been, it's been hard, team, okay? <laughs> We're going to take a few stabs at rolling the presidential republic die. Let's see. So the intelligentsia, the trade unions, the samurai, and the industrialists are all going to like this. It will radicalize the Buddhist monks, and the shogunate and PB do not like it. I don't care. They're currently trying to bolster the PB, but we will give that a stop. Uh, let's bolster the intelligentsia. We are going to need their assistance, unfortunately. All right. Uh, I was messing around with all of my production methods, so... When I unpause here, things could go very sideways. Let's find out. Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, yeah. That's not good. That is not good. I can't even fix it at max taxes. Hmm. That is no bueno. Let's see if I can fix that real quick before I show you around. It looks like the biggest problem is paper. I am spending so much money on paper. There are almost twice as many buy orders as there are sell orders. And coal is also a big problem. Those seem to be the two main issues. Tools are always an issue. And of course, because we are still isolationism, I cannot do anything about that. So let's pop up the paper mills. Uh, we'll get these two going because they were almost done as well. And I'll let this ride for a little bit. We'll ride max taxes as well. Sorry, guys. Dump the military a little bit. Uh, I might want to remove this. Eh, it's fine. All right. So, I hope this fixes things. We do have quite a bit of a reserve. We're sitting at almost a 4 million reserve, so we can sit through this a little bit. Here is our country, our beautiful country of Japan. Of course, we took over all of this. Uh, don't look at this. Can I subsidize this? I cannot. Hmm. We need more tools. If I weren't isolationism, I could just... Ooh, this isn't good. <laughs> okay, we need tools and paper. Tools and paper. Gonna need that. Okay. Well, hopefully this works itself out. There's a revolt down here. Look at that. The peasant revolt. Nah, the bloody peasants. 
We have a, a stake in the land here of Australia. Which is beautiful. We also own the South Island. Isn't that nice? Apparently we're unable to hire people. Alas. We also own this tiny speck of North Island, but... Yeah, whatever. We also own Alaska. We stole this from <laughs> Russia. They were also the ones who recognized us. Isn't that nice? I assure you. It was not of their own free will. We forced that. We also own... <laughs> all of Chile. Very good, very good. I probably should build this lead too as well. We'll get around to it. We'll get around to it. I need more tools. What is this? Ah, right. We also uh, vassalized Argentina. But unfortunately, I vassalized them thinking that I could just absorb them in time like you can with puppets. But I don't think you could absorb a vassal. Which sucks a little bit. What? Con Wait, how did this happen? How did Kanak... Aren't they a decentralized power? How the heck? I have no idea what just happened here. Looks like South Africa is having some issues as well. France is absorbing loads amount of the East India Company with like a defensive pack. Now screw you. Loads of um, Africa. The U.S. is involved as well. The U.S. has also expanded quite nicely. They are destroying Mexico. But yeah, for 1892, I don't think this is too bad. We also own Celebs. This is my favorite little island nation here. And we own North Bonio. Closer to home, because they have gold. So I, I took it. <laughs> I took it. There is a revolution going on. To preserve theocracy. The PB and the Buddhist monks are interested in keeping it. I couldn't understand why. But uh, we're going to slap that down. Russia has declared their rivalry. I did take Alaska from them, So like... I'm not that surprised. Alright. Just do the thing. What is this? No, no. The Japanese religious revolt. Revolution is upon us. I'm sorry, what is happening? They have quite a lot more people than I thought. Oh dear. Fine. Mobilize everybody. Mired in particular crap. Uh, we're going to have to cut through some red tape here. I'm going to try and make this happen. There's also going to be a secession. Uh, which is great. Why are you guys standing by? I don't know. A rubber rush. Cool. This is a great time for a secession. Is it up here? Oh. Great. I'm a little busy, guys. That's probably happening because we're running max taxes right now. Yes, yes, yes. Go, go, go. The voice of the nation. Now that's a cool anthem. Look at that. We are a great power all of a sudden. I'm oh, sorry, I paused it. Um, let's see. Is that someone standing by? Yes. Can I get an invasion? Sure. I think, hold on. I've unlocked socialism, great. No, I don't know why they're just standing by. Why can't I do anything with you guys? Oh, I don't think they have people. Hmm. That would be why. I could activate conscripts, but that would be not great. Mother fucker. 
Ah, uh, really? Great Britain just had to get involved. They don't like me. They want to put me in my place, so I'm going to have to put them in their place. Yeah, yeah, sure. Oh! The Dutch East Indies is going to war with Great Britain. Thankfully, this might be a distraction of some kind. I hope. This should be fine. We should be good. Uh, this isn't good. But... The rest of this should be good. I think this is only red because of the secession, to be honest. Well, the revolution. Yep, I was afraid of this. But thankfully... We crushed him. We crushed him good. I have no coal. Uh-oh. Money's disappearing. Peace. Yes. Thank you. Okay. What is happening? I have no money. Because we have no coal. Why do I have no coal? I don't know. Probably because I have so many things running coal right now. Okay, coal mines. Yes? What seems to be the problem? Oh, do we have a shortage of dynamite? I don't know. I have no idea what's happening. <laughs> Is it because... Oh dear. Well, we might have to uh, cut off some of our coal. I can always go into... Where is it? Down here. Turn off a few of these. Okay. Construction is winding down, so that's why our money is recovering. We are about to have another tick through of the presidential republic. How is our legitimacy? It's falling. But that's okay. Can I pull you guys in for more? You guys like what we're doing, right? You are neutral towards all the things. Okay, sure. And what is this? Uh, sure. Great. Oh, look at that. The Buddhist monks have been absolutely destroyed. I guess because I killed them all? We have a presidential republic! Uh, my standard of living is plummeting. So our radicals are climbing swiftly. <laughs> swiftly. Swiftly. So. We ha now have a military dictatorship. Interesting. I don't know how this happened. Hmm. Okay, so far... My expectations... Have, um... Been surprising. Or been... What am I trying to say? <laughs> 
I did not expect this to happen. That's what I'm trying to go with here. So with the Presidential Republic, I think we try and switch back to monarchy. So. Oh, before that, though. Is it because we're autocratic? Huh. There's a high chance we landed vote here. What if we do this? Let's switch to landed voting here. Could do wealth voting. No, let's landed vote. Uh, the samurai aren't too pleased about this, but who cares? It'll be easy to push us through, it looks like. There's even a movement happening for it. So we'll we'll push through landed vote and then we'll switch back to monarchy. Uh, I'll try and get the rest of this under control here, I think. Because money is a problem. And that was the first tick. We have a landed voting. Look at it. Isn't it beautiful? I am going to have to uh, change my authority. So, did I change this? We now have a president. Yoshifuru Nabemishi. Now, we have a problem. <laughs> Our government is quite illegitimate. And with a... With a completely illegitimate government, you cannot pass laws. So we have two ways we could do this. One, we could just yeet everyone out now and try and find something that works. Uh, two would be to wait. Okay, we're gonna wait. Uh, so the, what we're gonna do, I suppose, now is just wait for the first vote to come through. During an election, the new legitimacy system, the way it works, is when an election happens, the people who win the election make your government legitimate. Who could have seen that coming? So, I guess I'm just going to wait for the next election. And in the meantime, just so you know what's going on, I am building all of the coal mines in the world. Kyushu is about to become the coal mine capital of the world. Because this is a problem. And hopefully, I can fix it. As for the rest of our authority, what is... Ugh. All right. We'll dump the tea tax. Taxing tea is un unconstitutional anyway. The election results are in the Conservative Party pulled in a whopping 73%. Alrighty. Now, after an election, you can freely change your government without there being any radical additions. So, uh, what do we do? We can kick out the Samurai and make it to a contested government. If I kick out the Progressive Party, we're still a contested government, but the only person in the Conservative Party is the Shogunate. Uh, although... No, no, we'll just confirm this. And we are going to switch back now to a monarchy. The question, my friends, is at hand. Can we become an emperor and restore Japan to its former glory? Uh, was it actually glory? I don't know. Let's find out. Let's answer the scientific question. And we are now a monarchy, which I believe means, according to that flag that I see on the top left, we have returned to a shogunate government. Ah, uh, a pity. I was afraid of this, but, um... Hey, that's why we do this stuff, for scientific experiments. So, we went from... My, what a roundabout way we did this. We went from a shogunate to a theocracy to a military dictatorship to a president all the way back to a shogun. Is it possible to reseat the Japanese emperor? I don't know. Honestly, I kind of don't think so. Because my reasoning, I don't know if it's correct, but it is my reasoning. The monarchy is tied to the landowner faction, which for Japan is the shogunate. I think it's just plain emperor if it's landowner. Like if it's just called landowner, it's not special because there are all sorts of monarchies that are special monarchies. Like there's a caliphate, there's the Kaiserreich for uh, Austria, and I believe Prussia as well, which is having a revolt... Oh, look, you're a constitutional monarchy. How nice. The Khedive. That sort of thing. 
Egyptian landowners? Well, maybe. I don't know. But I think I answered the question. I do not believe it is possible to reseat the Japanese emperor. If you do believe it is possible, or if you know it is possible, feel free to let me know. Which government did you like the most? The theocracy? The theocracy flag was really cool. The uh, military dictatorship? The republic? I love democracy. I love the republic. Or, of course, the tried the true, the Tokugawa. Showing an imperial rural party. Wow, that's changed. As for this legitimacy system, I uh, have mixed feelings on this system. I like the idea, the, the caught up part here, but I have found that in like, in an autocratic sort of situation, once you add a faction to the government, it is almost impossible to remove them. That's why you end up with a government that just has literally everybody in it, because removing them will reduce your legitimacy. Now, it's gone up and down, I think. I think it depends on your pops and, like, what, who's in what party and whatever, but I don't know the exact details. I don't know. I just think it's confusing. And I had an issue where I was playing as Finland with uh, elections. And my legitimacy, just like every election cycle, my legitimacy plummeted. Even if I only put in the people who won. My, my legitimacy just kept going down and down and down until eventually I couldn't pass any laws because... At the final level of illegitimacy, you cannot enact laws. I don't know. You can let me know what you think or if I'm just completely out of my mind. They want to rejoin the Progressive Party, but guess what? They can't. I could get that, kick them out. <laughs> just have the Imperial Rule Party. And maybe we would have to in the future. But this is the probably the end of the Japanese Shogunate. We have gone full circle. Let me know if you'd like to see more. Victoria 3. I do have plans for one more series, but it has been... Oh, it's been hard to piece together. It really has. Good old Finland. Thank you for watching. I hope that you enjoyed. Thank you to the patrons and channel members who support the channel. I greatly appreciate you. And if you'd like to stay up to anything happy on the channel, feel free to join the Discord in the description down below. I'll see you next time for perhaps some more science and perhaps a proper playthrough. Bye!